There we go. Yeah, this is not an original SMS. This is a power base converter. All right, this is going to be bad. I know that you can jump over this skeleton. Nope, not that way though. Oh gosh, my timing is so bad. I actually wanted to co collect some money here. Oh no. I was afraid of this. The pause button actually is on, on the console itself. That sucks. God, the block pattern's different. This is the worst. How is this allowable? Oh, um, the timing of knocking me down to one heart is different. Uh, I'll try that after I inevitably get frustrated and, uh, and reset this. Actually, no, I'm not going to reset. We are playing this one through to the end. Timer. I thought that I was told that there was a timer in this game. No, I wanted to fire downwards. Let's go. Hyped uh, for being gated by the stones? No, I'm not. There's a good word for what I am, but hyped is not it. 
That's actually why I'm farming money. Oh my god, am I on the seed? I'm taking this hit just in case. I was not on the seed. Timing's different. Yeah, that's fair. I'll take that. Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, you have to press the console uh, pause button for the menu. Which is... Everything is slightly different and it's really throwing me off. Literally everything is very slightly different. This is the worst. Timing doesn't work in this game. Take three. Yeah, this is like, I mean, 
it's very clear that the, uh... That the remake was super faithful to it. It's also very clear that they're, like, all the little tweaks that I was, you know, technically aware that they made really stand out now. Okay. Okay. No, that's that's great. One one snake will jump over me, but just one, apparently. Oh yeah. Your heart. It's not a heart. Oh my gosh. I don't love the, the button combination that I have to hit to, uh, to use the, the magic. All of the enemies move in slightly different ways. Okay, that's creepy. Had a feeling. are really finicky. Okay, I believe, yeah. I was told that they changed the frog behavior a ton in the remake because of the fact that frogs were basically free. Wanna, wanna maybe? Holy shit. Okay, well that frog was not free. I don't know if it's coming across on the, uh... Holy shit, no. No, no, no! This is bad. I really don't like this. This is not an okay situation to be in. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if it's coming across on the... on the stream, but boy does this feel like it's 30 frames per second. That still works. Starting further up. Okay, this is bad.
Yo, John, how's it going? I'm gonna be honest, I'm not doing super well. Yeah, this is a really good demon. shameful thing. I'm gonna get a second heart. I've already game overed enough. Let's let's prevent further game overs. Whoops. That's gonna take getting used to. Yeah, insurance hearts are pretty good. I expected this to be kind of a, a funny run. On account of me, you know, having never played it before and the expectation being that I'm gonna be bad. Okay, those jumps are way harder at 30 frames per second. Okay. No, that's great. I didn't say I hate the old version. Said the old version is definitely very hard, and it does show its age. Okay, armor. Gotta do it with the jump. That stinks. I don't like that. Okay, control here is much harder. I'm not surprised that that happened. Alright, I'm getting the safety potion.
I know. Well, that's that's because the the menu button is literally on the console. Okay, no, that's great. No, this is fantastic. Yep. Whenever you swing your sword, even when you're stuck to the things, you come to a complete stop. Do you exist? Yes, it was a charm stone I walked past. I I don't know, Colonel Panic, but that's that is exactly what happened. They they put the the pause button on the console itself. <laughs> no, I'm sure I'll be fine without them. You don't buy the Tasmanian sword in this run, so. The controls are so finicky in this. That's that's what really strikes me is just how unfriendly and finicky these controls are. I apologize, everyone. I'm being so bad at reading chat. Um, this game is forcing me to pay just a little bit more attention. Oh, 
okay, I don't get a heart rate though. That's nice. Is, is the ghost not gonna come back? Okay, I can respawn. There we go. Thank you. You don't get a heart from that. Garrett, I'm sorry. I was having some issues with my internet earlier tonight, which made it really tough to stream. Very kind of you all to say that you prefer that I'm when I'm streaming. I'm just not thinking right now. Am I still going to do the glitch? Um, I'm going to attempt to, yes. can't do that now. Notice over here, uh, there's two blocks where that unknown usually is. So it doesn't work here, but I'll show you where I am going to try and use it. Well, now I'm a dragon, but now I'm a mouse. Yeah, so turning into a bird early there doesn't- that's not a glitch in this version of the game. 
That is a exclusive glitch to the to the remake. Oops. I'm supposed to go over here and hit this block. Please? Please! Oh my god, controls. Anybody who, who is even a little bit epileptic, I apologize, really sincerely. Then uh, that one for sure. Okay, so I'm using just a plain old Genesis controller, uh, which means that I may or may not be able to pull off a fish flight. It's gonna be tough. Reminder that the only reason that we can pull it off at 60 frames per second, which is, to be fair, harder, is because we're able to use both an analog and D-pad. Super, super hard. Um, my understanding is most people who did it on console used a uh, used a uh, aftermarket controller that had like a joystick that you could wiggle quickly. Yes, Colonel Panic. They did port this glitch over into the remake. Wrong. 
of money I need. Yep, the other thing that I'm about to take advantage of is a glitch that was also ported, although they changed the rules slightly. Well, fine, I will pick up that heart. Although this is less of a glitch and more of an Easter egg. Um, if I recall correctly, the, the nickname for the Easter egg was the Golden Sword. I'm about to be able to make golden blocks out of nothing. Doors in this game. Oh, hey. You know, I already did get the Thunder Sword. Yeah, um... Hard to control is certainly one way to put it. Okay, I think that I have enough gold. I need to be a mouse. It's true, all of my precious visual cues are gone. Um, in case you didn't catch it earlier, uh, the way that you use magic spells, um, for one, you have to pause to select whatever magic spell you want to use. Um, but another really important note here... Oh no. Is there anything that I can... Armor? Lamellar? 86? 51. 86. No! I need... I need more charm. I'm gonna go buy some charm. Excuse me. Anyway. The, uh, the way that you use spells is by holding down and then pressing jump and swing your weapon. That hasn't changed. Thank you. 
think 1520 is enough. Just have to hope that I have enough charm stones at this point. Extra charm stone certainly isn't going to make me complain. Anyway, I need to buy a shield here. Dude, which controller are you using? Are you using the original SMS controller? Later, Kironeko. Uh, Wonder Boys 1 and 2 are more arcade style games. I have a copy of Wonder Boy 2 coming in. I'll be able to show that off when it gets in. Alright. Well, we're gonna go the intended route for now. Primarily because I legit don't know what else I need to buy or if it's just like a I should have farmed more charm stones sort of thing. like to point out how amazingly impressive this is for an 8-bit system. This is ridiculous for 8-bits. And it is definitely not without its flaws, but Oh god, I'm used to being able to just rush that screen. Also, holy cow, they made swimming so much better in the, in the remake. Swimming is just... It's not fun. Thank <laughs> you. 
Should have taken a hit if I'm being honest. It's fine. It's also fine. Okay, that was lucky. Positioning is really hard. And the timing is not trivial either. So what's up with these chests? Like, is it really supposed to just never give you a... Uh... Yeah, I was afraid that that was going to be the case. Uh, I'm not super excited about doing this with this particular sword. Oh, wow. You've got to be way... That doesn't work anymore. There's no indication that there's a, a nurse's station there. That's fine, that's fine. On the lava. Cool. Luckily, the flowers don't murder you the same way. Oh, right. I don't have a second controller. I've only got the one, which means that the Tasmanian sword is totally useless to me. Oh, by the way, to use the Tasmanian sword in this game, uh, it requires that you have a, um, a second controller. Hey, Roguelink, how's it going? Is it possible to unlock bird with mouse? It is not. Well, not conventionally. Um, so, in this version of the game, 
the uh, the Tasmanian sword unlocks all of the um, all of the the forms, not just the ones that you've already unlocked. So once you get that, like you're set, you're good. This is gonna suck. Yeah, this is gonna suck. Yeah, Rogue Link, I believe it. Oh, sick today. I'm sorry to hear that. Hey, Saturn Meteor. Yeah, this is the original. Okay. Let's think. Okay. I've got 105 charm points. I changed to a mouse and I have fewer, I think. What's the next armor that I can even buy? Wait. Oh, this doesn't matter. I need to be a fish to go over there. There we go. That's what I needed. That'll let me buy the rest of the armor. CP is charm points. It determines what I'm allowed to buy. Basically, how charming I am determines whether or not shopkeepers are willing to talk to me. They removed it from the remake, and I think it's a good move. I don't think that it really made the game any more fun. if I can get uh, a shield now. Yes! Alright. Okay, arm list. Magical saber. Shield list. Knight shield. Armor list. Goblin mail.
think that I have to have fireball selected. Crap. I know where I can buy a fireball. No, no, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, wow. Really, dude? I guess I can't buy a fireball there. Okay, let me find out how to... I do, I do need the, uh, I do need a fireball so I can have it selected. Oh, I should. Alright. Just hunting for a, uh, a fireball here. Okay, I just need you to give me your secret magic and then I'm going to stop killing all of you. Nice try. There we go. All right. I'm just going to get here, use a return door. I'm going to be set. are finicky. Like, super, super finicky. No, Hockey, you're delightful. You would have at least 7 CP.
it is in the remake. They changed the way that it works. Um, in the remake, you require a minimum number of charm stones. Oh wow, this hallway is way less exciting in this <laughs> in the original. Yeah, yeah, the, the magic saber thing is in the is in the remake as well. I don't need money at this point. Yeah, in the in the um, in the remake, they just made it so that you have to have at least four charm stones for that to work. You know, all things considered, that's much faster. Yeah, the remake is definitely much, much more beginner for me. Okay. Da, 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 da. Armor list. Legendary. Arm list. We're good. Alright, let's finish this out. Sure would be nice to have potions. Like, it would be really, really nice to have potions. We're probably gonna game over at least one more time. Okay, green bats work different. Snakes are actually pretty broken. jump does not work the same as in the remake. gonna get it. Oh my god. Heart. Please heart. Why? Alright. You have the chance to give me hearts. It's just selfish. It's just selfish. Counterproductive. Mm. 
You know what? I'm gonna do the thing where you take a loop. Because this dude, I think, still has... Oh my gosh. Yes, he does have a big heart. Okay, cool. Worth. Totally worth it. expect it to happen. Really didn't expect it to actually happen. in the door. Alright, well you're gonna drop a potion. It's like a very small instant use potion. See if I can do the strap. Oh god, why are you moving weird? Oh my god, stop. Stop moving weird. Yo, Skatey4, how's it going? I honestly don't know the, the technical differences between the two. not sure if it's a better use of color or that it has the ability to display more colors. Um, yeah, that's a really good question. Alright, never opening that menu again. So there's a really neat bug in this game. Um, for some reason, uh, once you have the Hades armor equipped, as long as you don't open the menu ever again, uh, you can't die. I mean, you can die, but... Oh yeah, I need to go buy a, a key. But yeah, you can you can die, technically, but it always resurrects you, as opposed to just once. 
Yeah, Skatey 4 is Team Moogle. I managed mm -hmm. to catch most of your run. It was really, really fun to watch. Oh, fine. Uh, Hades. Oh, yeah. Hades armor really doesn't give you a lot of charm points, does it? 25 colors simultaneously from the NES versus 32 from the Master System. There we go. So yes, it does display a few more colors simultaneously. appreciate those seven bonus colors. I mean, just as a percentage, that's a lot of colors. No! Well, that bug still exists. basically got more colors as it went along. Oh, because of mappers. Yeah, that's fair. Or not so much more colors as interesting, smarter use of color, I think is probably fair to say. MC5 apparently added the ability to give tiles their own palettes. Okay, that's really cool. Like, from a technical standpoint, that's really impressive. It's not a cheat, it's a bug in the game's code. Uh, there was a mistake when they coded the Hades armor. Uh, it never decides whether or not uh, to remove the flag from the Hades armor, specifying that you can uh, be resurrected by it until you, uh, until you open the menu again. So for that reason, I'm never opening the menu again. It is legal in every one of the speedrun categories that there are for this game. Ninjas. 
All right, that was awesome. I, I just, I want to put that out there. Those, that series of dodges, like, anybody would have been proud of that. The rest of my gameplay, not so much. Not, not stellar, but, but those dodges in particular were pretty darn good. Yeah, you have to never open the, uh, well, the armor menu specifically. Looking at the armor is what causes it to reevaluate whether that bit needs to continue being set. is so much harder when you don't have the one. Okay, wings should not be part of the hitbox. Had to die one more time, for good measure. Just to make sure. Yes, so I am using a Powerbase FM, um, and I also have a region modded Genesis. It's got a little switch that allows me to determine whether or not it reports that it's a Japanese or a um, or a US Mega Drive. And the Wonder Boy 3 card is really interesting in that it doesn't just query whether or not the hardware is present. Uh, for it to be willing to query whether or not FM hardware is even present, uh, due to the fact that it was only ever available in Japan, it first queries whether or not you have a Japanese region reported. So when I have it in Japanese mode, I get FM synthesis. When I uh, put it in US mode, uh, the FM synthesis is totally cut out. Um, this is going to be probably the end of the stream for tonight, but I will um, I'll reset in US mode real quick to show that off. It's a it's a neat thing, like it even changes the title screen and stuff. But yeah, it's the what I'm using is the Powerbase Mini FM uh, from uh, Stone Age Gamer. I'm not at all related to them, or I don't have any like business ties. I just I ordered it and I got it in today, so I was really excited. So uh, Meg Mac Attack. Um, it's not that they crippled the hardware necessarily for the U.S. Um, it's that the base units, both in the U.S. and in um, and in Japan, did not have the FM synthesis. The FM synthesis was an add-on that only ever released in Japan. 
that said, the, the Famicom's extra sound channel does, it's really good. Um, the first time that I ever played uh, Castlevania 3 was on a, a Japanese Famicom, and the US soundtrack doesn't sound right to me as a result. But personally, I, I love I love the uh, the sound of FM synthesis. Um, I think that FM synthesis just sounds amazing. So I was really excited that you know uh, that there was a an FM add-on supporting um, version of the the power base converter. Also, Meg Mac Attack, I totally missed your resubscription. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Thank you very, very much for the resubscription. Um, just a reminder to everybody, all the money that I get from Twitch, um, be it through Cheers or from subscriptions, goes directly to Extra Life Charity. Uh, the, the campaign that I send all the money to is linked in my stream info. Um, and yeah, you can, you can see, you know, just directly exactly how how much of a difference you're all making yo evan grill thank you also for the subscription thank you so so much i can have your your twitch prime this month you are awesome okay i don't know if it's gonna let me Let's try pause, see if it, okay, nope, it, it stays here in a loop forever. So I will turn off my Genesis, flip the switch to US mode, turn it on, that probably sounds closer to what anybody who's in the U.S. remembers. Yo, Piece of Hannah, thank you so much for the subscription. You are all just awesome, amazing people. That's true, I did technically turn off a Mega Drive and turn on a Genesis. Here's good. Now I've started, I may as well finish this run. No, it's a bit too late for that. block pattern here. I'm so, like, the remake's block pattern is hardwired into my head. With all these subs, soon I'm going to be playing Final Fantasy VII. That is going to happen at 75 subs. We are at 59 right now. Hey, Eldonia, how's it going? You're you're pretty close to the end of the stream. I'm just uh, I was showing off the uh, the ability of this game to swap between whether or not it uses uh, the FM synthesis or 
the original soundtrack based on the region that my Genesis reports. Hit 300 subs, am I going to play Final Fantasy 15? Um, unlikely. I don't have a, a PS4 and I don't really anticipate purchasing one. So this is a Master System game uh, playing through a power base converter in a Genesis. But so if I were to flip the switch, then turn it back on. So now it's reporting Japanese region again, and we're going to get Monster World 2 instead of Wonder Boy 3. And we'll get that beautiful, chunky FM synthesis sound. Did this come out for Game Gear? Yes, I think that they changed the name slightly for the Game Gear release, but, but this was out on Game Gear as well. <laughs> 